ranked paid, unpaid, whatever. But today we have Sorry Tag as a sword versus Kuro the Suicune. Kuro not sounding too confident, but. It's kind of hard if Age Slash gets buffed. The key here is to not get Age Slash buff, which is it's, it's, she's succeeded at so far. Maybe Sorry Tag is just experimenting right now, because I have yet to see an Iron Head cancel from it. But anyway, Kuro has a nice lead right now. Mirror Coat is not going to help you a whole lot versus Age Slash, especially not in Duel, but that's not being used a whole lot in Duel. Alright, good job catching the end frames of King Shield, which you cannot just bust out. No. Sorry, Tech. Now has the attack buff and Rotom, and now he's scared in a scared position. Shadow Sneak pierces, so that's kind of going to do a lot of favors. What does a lot of favors for Kuro is Rotom's horrible scaling. Alright. Kuro had the right idea. Funny timing from Suicune's vulnerable frames caught her there. Sorry, Tech. Comboing into the 4Y, into the 4Y, into the Iron Head. That's. that's. yep. <laughs> She knew as soon as she saw the little grab animation, Kuro's like, oh, that's gonna hurt. Alright. Uh, as I was saying, I don't recommend Mirror Coat in this matchup unless you already know what Aegis Slash is gonna throw, because a lot of his stuff either pierces counter or uh, something like that. Alright, sorry, Tag King shielding that quite beautifully into a combo that kind of gets dropped. Six extra through mirror coat. And just applies the pressure and homing right at the wall. Alright, throws a burst. Uh sorry. Oh, he hit King Shield. Rage burst without a rate or without a burst age is last is gonna get hurt. Sort of. 250 damage is still pretty good. What I want Kuro to do is just start spamming Icy Wind and less Blizzard. Sorry, Talk, I think he's catching on to this Blizzard usage. Whoa, Gyro Ball outlasting so he can counter charge. And Sorry, Tag will take the first game here. Ha ha. <laughs> Sorry, Tag is of course stuck. Uh, I'm gonna bet nothing but goodwill on Kuro switching to Scissor. Yes. <laughs> I know this because she has a scissor! Ha 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 ha! I'm gonna show you some This matchup I know nothing about. Like, I know you can duck Scissor's counter, but he's gotta be recklessly countering for that to be super practical. Thursday! Alright, interesting exchanges going back and forth. Scissor finally gets some mileage off of U-turn. Again, sorry, Tag. Being a little bit reckless. A little bit reckless with that 6x there. Sorry, Tag, really trying to call out these counters from a distance, which is pretty smart, because he's rather far away and he can do a lot of this. Calls out 2x, unfortunately doesn't get the follow-up, and gets mashed back into field. JX frames do not outlast ca uh, Scissor's counter. Emolga, now I, this is super smart from Kuro. I don't know how much it was intentional, but Emolga versus Age Slash is not fun. Not fun at I saw all. I saw it. Good grabs from Kuro. Uh, I can picture she was expecting those counter frames to last longer, but they did not. Interesting usage from of Rotom. I do a lot, but Kuro's knocked down. Yeah, she's using these counters a lot well. I think this character is working a lot better for her right now. Unfortunately, side Y and Flash Cannon will take that round. Fortunate for Sorry Tag, of course. Alright, Sorry Tag starting to get super serious here. I frames through Molga. Accidentally drops the Gyro Ball combo, but that's okay because he still takes it into duel. Kuro goes right under that. Some scissor aerial stuff. I kind of wish she'd burn through her uh, burst because she's probably going to need it in the next round. 
And Scissor mysteriously gets his burst rather fast if you're playing well. I like these grabs. The grabs are good. Sorry, Tech trying to call out counters, but this is not working out so well. I think she's mixing her counters and her grabs pretty well, considering Aegis Slash is so weak to grabs. <gasps> Yo! Burst is going to take... <laughs> Sorry, Tech, not quite respecting Burst, and Kara will take advantage of this. Unfortunately, this will drain her meter for the next round. It's okay. Just crack your back. You'll be back into this. Her using Fennekin now. I don't know how I feel about this first Aegis Slash. I know Aegis Slash's movement's like super slow, so if you're in Fennekin range, have fun getting out of the way. Yeah, you're, I mean, at the very least, he's gonna get pushed back. Dull Sword into Sharp Sword. Alright, so they're trying to call it out. Again, right idea, poor timing on the counter frames. Juggling with 4Y from Aegis Slash. Kuro playing it very safe, trying to see some kind of pattern in Sorry Tag's mix-ups. Eh, okay. I'm not sure how that works. I know he just lashes one of the longest counters in the game. Okay, these, these counter frames are working out really nice for Kuro. Uh, that's gonna shut down Scissor's jump options. I mean... An interesting exchange once again. Oh, but Sorry Tag calls out the wake-up option and gets a grab. It was indeed very close, is what I'm hearing from over there. Sorry, Tech, we'll take this 2 0. Alright. 